Hello and welcome to my channel. If you're new, please go ahead subscribe, click the like, the bell notification. By the way, this video is not sponsored by MSOIL or anyone. Because I get a lot of comments like that. Oh, you're sponsored by MSOIL. No, I'm not sponsored by MSOIL or anyone. This is my personal experience, a personal use. It's not just MSOIL that I recommend. If I come across a product that works well, I will recommend my channel. So, today I'm going to show you something, guys, that, that I am very surprised what MSOIL oil and filter did to my engine you know when I read your comments I'm very sometimes speechless seeing the results that MSOIL have caused either to your engine or your transmission and you sharing on my channel but today I'm going to show you something what I found in a filter for the 12 months of driving a little bit longer maybe 12 and a half months what what I found in the filter, i never seen before on any filters, I always check the filter, you know, I let it sit for a day or two, all the oil drains off, and I want to see what's inside there. And, you know, I found very interesting stuff. And this filter, and this application, and this, and this V8 engine, it's the first time what I've seen in a filter itself that has been, uh, that has been done to the engine, and filter was able to capture that. So, let, let me zoom in and show you the first detail the first detail and you can actually pick it up you see that shiny stuff in the corner that right there that's something you see there's more it's like a or orange color this stuff right here this orange stuff so this is something that filter picked up and if I rotate the filter you're gonna see more of this stuff. See right there edges? Never seen that stuff before. And actually, this is something very interesting that oil picked up and why it picked up from the engine. I'm gonna explain to you. See that right there? More of that stuff. So it's like, what is this shiny stuff? So something, something inside the engine, the filter was with the oil combination. See, there's more on the engine, you know, that. crazy so let's take the filter apart cut it open and uh, see what or else we're gonna find and what is it I'm gonna show you guys I'm gonna explain to you very interesting so the filter is cut open I want you guys to notice something you see that orangey stuff the goldish color you see how much debris it picked up that orangey stuff see this stuff this 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 orangey stuff or brown whatever color you wanna you wanna say this stuff it's not normal and why did it happen to my engine I'm, I'll show you see there's more up there just this orange you know that's that's just it's 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 it so surprises me well not surprises me it's kind of I want you guys to notice how much of this stuff is there. Right there, you see? See the filter media? And then that that rust, not rust, who knows what that is? And then I want you guys to notice area of the filter where I did not, you know, split. And you can actually see it on the inside too. That's, there's a lot of that stuff and some of you say well it's just normal well it's not normal this is not normal this is the well every filter will have that kind of stuff now I want you to see something a comparison same same thing an engine ran for 13 months not a spot actually this filter has been sitting for much longer and it dried out too you see there is not a single spot of that orangey stuff yes you see the indentation of what i pressed on it but you're not gonna see 
anywhere of the orange stuff see because if I press here you see that stuff's there and you see next to it see that right there different color too so what is that stuff well that stuff actually is the carbon buildup that has been layered on the inside of the engine it's actually this stuff here using this piston you see that right there orange color that right there that's what it is so my engine has a lot of it I guess even though the previous owner was using full synthetic following factor recommended interval change but the problem is the full synthetic it should not be used for factor recommended change intervals and this is the reason why M soil filter was able to capture all the stuff and some of the chunks that you need to see it here here are there specks of black stuff carbon that was was captured look how, how much of this carbon build up orange stuff that was able to capture and trap it well this filter here it doesn't have a bit not even close because this vehicle has been using M soil for about five years now even though both about both, both of them used so so there you go so is it pays to use M soil or it costs to use M soil it pays to use M soil so it cleaned up the engine see this and you can actually see in the back too see if I can actually here a good spots right there you see that the difference there's little specks of that orangey stuff and actually you can see it on the inside too see how how deep how red that is that's right there that's an indication of oil doing its job and soil says you know that this signature series that I've been using has a lot of detergent and I have a separate video if you want to know more about this and what they say is true it's true it has more detergent that's why full synthetic left a lot of garbage behind and M soil is oil is doing its job now it's cleaning up no wonder people that have oil consumption issue left me comments that they saw instant results so that's just a one of the benefits is to use the M soil it will start cleaning your engine up from the previous motor oil that was used that was not doing its job it either was not doing its job or was being used longer than it should be should have been so if you want to use full synthetic oil the cheap stuff just change it every 3000 miles and you're not going to know what soil consumption is and you're not going to have that kind of stuff build up on your engine that filter is going to pick it up if you switch to M soil yeah you can see the spots definitely you can see where where that orange stuff so as you can see filter is full of removed build up carbon build up uh, from small black particles stuff to big chunks of goldish color carbon buildup that has been removed from the engine so the filter is doing its job by capturing and oil is doing its job by dissolving it actually well I'm not sure if it dissolves but removing it probably the proper way because if you dissolve it it should be you know part of the oil kind of but it removes the stuff so it, it actually conditions the engine so it performs like new again by removing the carbon buildup like I showed you I was using 0W20 that's the viscosity that it's recommended 
for my vehicle. If you have something that requires 520 or 020 or 040, use recommended viscosity. Uh, and if you want to try signature series, there will be a link in the description. You can try it. You can purchase it online. Because on, why online? Directly from MSOIL. Because that's the lowest price you're going to get. And so I want to thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and share with others. Thank you.